Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Renegade Platinum. This is part 36, and we're in Crash Awake's gym. It is permanently raining, but I had a good idea. So, I taught Stretch Sunny Day um, instead of Earthquake. Hopefully we won't need Earthquake. But the point is, um, I will Sunny Day up, and then I only need to Dragon Dance once, since um, Chlorophyll will boost my speed already. So, um, we'll have a Life Orb, uh, single dragon dance which is basically plus two because of the life orb and then we will also be double speed so hopefully we'll be able to sweep with that and that's my plan i also forgot to buy more movie milks but i'll do that before i fight crash awake if i need to i probably won't need to let's see uh i'm not gonna give the uh give tropius the life orb right now because I don't like taking damage, just some random. Actually, no, we'll keep the life orb, because we can just heal after every battle. No big deal. B-barrel. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Um, that's not good. Okay, let's see. I don't think there's really anything we can do to deal with this here. It might be plus four. Am I dead? Oh my god. Gastro is the greatest thing in existence. If it went for Aqua Tail, we'd be dead. So let's just thank, thank everything that, that didn't happen. I don't remember what's coming out. Let's send out Pika Blue. It's always a safe bet. Celio. Drain Punch can take care of this. Hopefully Peekaboo doesn't hit himself and we can just aqua jet this. Sweet. Next is War Turtle. Um Dang, I'm so scared of ice type moves. Literally all these Pokemon can just have ice type moves. Um Stretch can just leaf blade this. Iron defense. That's still did decent damage. That guy gave me like no money. I think it's just because of his trainer class. Kindergartners, like, or at least tubers, children, they don't give you much money. The reason I ran back to the Pokemon Center to heal is just because conserving money. I mean, I can buy a billion, you know, moon milks, but at the same time, it still costs money, so might as well heal that way if I don't uh, need to use my moon milks. Let's lead with Stretch here. Hopefully he doesn't lead with a Water Ice type. Wish Cash, easy pickings. We can just, let's just test out the Sunny Day. Now Stretch should be able to deal with anything. Seeking. Dead. You know what, Tropius is actually pretty good for dealing with stuff like this. And Lantern. Cool. And you know, I just said, I was just talking about saving money and I immediately waste a potion on that. Oh well, I don't feel like walking back to the Pokemon Center. Pelipper. Yeah, we're gonna switch. I don't want to get hurricaned before I have a chance to sunny day. Uh, Charlize has Thunder Punch, but it's also raining, and I don't want to risk, like, Hydro Pump. Well, he's not gonna go for Hydro Pump against Stretch here. He's gonna go for Hurricane, and I'm sure that Charlize can survive a Hurricane. Okay, it has Air Slash. Thunder Punch. It lived, and it has Tailwind. Okay, that Tailwind's gonna be a problem. Golduck, uh, definitely gonna have Ice Beam. We'll send out Pico Blue, just cause it's 
strong enough to take whatever Golduck has. I think Golduck's a psychic type in this game. It probably is. The only thing that's, like, gonna hurt is my Aqua Jet when I turn on the sun. I don't need Double Edge. Because Peekaboo's Aqua Jet is strong even against water types when it's raining like this. Wow. You don't need to miss these play roughs. I wish I had a wide lens. I could just give it a wide lens. But honestly, the muscle band is much better, so... I'll just buy some Mumu Milks before I fight Crasher. Crasher? Is that is that what I should call him? Or is his name Wake? Is Crasher his title? Wait. Maybe I'll do like Wake. Yeah, his name is Wake. Okay. So calling him Wake is what you're supposed to... Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. I just wanted to see what the button would do. Uh, that won't have anything. We can just sunny day. Oh, and by won't have anything, I mean it'll have belly drum, but I'm faster than it now, so no big deal. I mean, he could have aqua jetted me, but it's also sunny, so no problems there. Dugong, um, that might survive a leaf blade. We're gonna switch out. I can't risk getting ice beamed before I have a chance to fight Crasher Wake. Dugong, Dugong, Dugong. Uh, we'll send out Charlie's. Because it's sunny and I'm not in any danger, I can just flame thrower it. Wow, that still did nothing. Let's see how much Thunder Punch does. It did basically the same amount. <clears throat> Marsh Tomp. Wow, he's trying to stall out the sun. Which he did do. Actually, I definitely shouldn't heal now since I'm right next to the end exit. Wait, am I not? Is this the wrong way? Where am I? How do I get out? Oh, I have to click this. Wait, no, I'm actually just completely lost. I don't know how to get out of here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I have a terrible sense of direction. I'm just gonna go buy some more Moon Milks now. While I don't think we're gonna need like 90 for the gym, I uh, might need 90 for the gym, so let's just be safe and get a billion of them. get like four dozen. Uh, we're almost at the point where Moomoo Milks aren't going to be very effective on my team because they're higher than like 100 health, but for now they are the greatest thing in existence. Like even now our team's super high health so we might just have to use those hyper potions instead. Hopefully we can just stick to the um, Moo Moo Milks. I'll buy some more Hyper Potions too at the Pokemon Pastoria. Where is the Pokemon? Layout of this city is so weird. There it is. Oh, we can't buy Hyper Potions here. Wait, am I just blind? No, we can't buy them here. I'll have to go back to Veilstone to get some. Well, we have 10. That should be okay. Especially when, with how often, like, we can just use Moomoo Milks instead. I don't 
don't have to battle that guy. So we won't. We do have to battle this guy though. Slow bro. That's gonna have Ice Beam. Uh, what beats slow bro? I don't have anything that beats slow bro on my team. That's a yikes. Pika Blue uh, is what I'm gonna send out. Cool. Who's next? Gastrodon. Oh wow, it has Sludge Bomb, but that even that didn't do that much. We should be able to just Aqua Jet this. It's neutral. Mantine. That has no defense. Also, we can probably Aqua Jet this too. Um, let's see how much damage it does, I'm just curious. Yeah, exactly. Right, let's just check our PP. I need to, because if I'm low, I do need to leave. Nah, we're fine. We can just stay. Okay. Here we go. Crash your wake battle. Let's lead with... I don't know. I don't know. If I if they lead with an ice type, then I'll have big problems. Let's lead with Gastro. Just so we can be completely safe. And we can just stall against whatever happens. Quagsire. Uh, that could have had a nice day move, but I think we're completely safe against that. So we'll send out Stretch, because he's going to Earthquake me now. There it is. Now we can go for Sunny Day. It has Ice Punch. Ouch. Okay, that, that's fine. We're faster, we can Leaf Blade it, get it off the screen. Oh no, please die. Well, <laughs> I guess we got completely pranked there. But it's still sunny. We don't really benefit from the sun, though. But at least they don't benefit from the rain anymore. But at the same time, if they set up another rain dance, that could be real bad. It doesn't really matter who we send out here. We'll just send out Charlize and click Thunder Punch. No, wait, that's bad. <laughs> Flamethrower. Okay. Um, we'll go for Dragon Balls. Oh, he switched. Uh, what is this gonna do? Aqua Tail me? I'm not weak to that, so I'll have to click Thunder Punch instead. Yeah, okay. Good, now that his Gyarados is gone, Quagsire is coming back in. Um... Hmm... What do we do about Quagsire? Could try to sea bomb it, but it's probably faster than me. Yeah, let's stay in. I'm not weak to ground, and his water type moves might hurt a little, but they probably won't kill me. So we'll click Dragon Pulse. His recover. Oh no. He just went for it twice. I didn't think he'd do that. Okay, yeah. He's, if he goes for Aqua Tail again, uh, what can we do about this? Let's go for Carry. He won't have anything super effective against me. And we'll just heal the other. We'll heal Charlie's just for later. And then we can click Ice Beam. Okay, I'm faster than it, so it's dead. Sweet. Polyrath. That can kill Carry pretty easily. I don't think Polyrath gets anything that would beat Pika Blue though. So this might be our belly drum chance. Oh my god, of course. I'm not wasting time waiting to wake up. Okay, well he's going for Waterfall, so he must not have anything else. Now I just need it to let 
me kill him. Oh, he didn't forget open up Gnosis. That's surprising, actually. Play rough. Cool. I'm asleep again. <laughs> I hate this thing so much. How does how does he always land hypnosis? But I never land hypnosis. Yeah, die. Goodbye. Ludicolo. Ah, man, that's a problem. We can't aqua jet that. Okay, well, time to switch. Uh, I think Charlie's is our best bet here. It's probably gonna set up the ring again. Oh, it has Hydro Pump. Please don't kill. See? Charlie's never dies. Uh, does it get Aqua Jet? I don't think it does. Let's click Dragon Pulse. Charlize is carrying us through a water gym. That's one of the most surprising things ever. Uh, okay, Floatzel for sure has Ice Fang. But will it have, like, Earthquake? I don't think so. Toxic. Wow, that Aqua Tail. You can't be missing Toxic! Wait, 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 wait. How did I miss Toxic? Hold on. Oh, you know what? I don't think that is added yet. In Gen 7, or maybe it's Gen 6, Poison types can't miss Toxic. Crap, that's terrible. This is real bad. Well, if he goes for Aqua Tail again, then Carrie will heal. We have to risk that. Yeah, okay, good. Crunch. That won't do much. Sweet. I think we got it. Let's see, lowers my defense. Yeah, there's his hyper potion. We should be able to just psychic this to death. He keeps critting me. Okay, one more time. I don't want him to crit me a third time and have to lose carry that way. There goes my defense, but it's dead now, so no big deal. Sharpedo. That has Ice Fang for 100% sure. Pika Blue should be able to just drain punch this after I heal for safety. You know, if this was a Gen 6 game, this Sharpedo would most definitely be Mega. Let's be thankful it is not a Mega, and it's just going to die. Well, it has Focus Sash, but it is also dead now. Goodbye. Wow, I actually beat the gym. I mean, I lost Stretch, which is really disappointing, but Stretch honestly carried the game. I would not have been able to beat Crasher Wake if it was still raining. If it was still raining, I would be 100% dead. So, let's everyone say thank you to Stretch for sacrificing himself to save the rest of our team. Thank you, Stretch. Moment of silence. Okay, moment of silence over. So I think the next thing we're gonna do is, um, I think we have to go to the, yeah, we're going to the bomb, which is at the Lake Verity? Or is it Lake Valor? I don't remember the lake names. But first, we need to heal up. We also need to find a new member of our team, which we'll do next time. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. We actually managed to beat Crash Awake. I thought that would be the end. <laughs> but, so yeah, thanks for watching. Next time we'll be back, we'll deal with the Team Galactic, and we'll head on to our sixth badge.